Hey everyone, Tyler with Bushcraft here. Today I want to show you three basic, very simple knots I use when I'm out on a bushcraft or a camping trip. These knots can be used for like a survival situation as well. Uh, I got my algae bottle here today. We could just pretend that this is a tree. All right, so for our first knot is going to be the top line hitch. All we're going to do is we're going to go around the tree. We're going to take the curve cord that's on the left cross that over on the top we're going to take the running in which is the one that we had put over top as you guys can see right here on top of the curve we're going to run that right on through up and over and we're going to do that again just like that and then we're going to run it over on top of the other one and run that through so then right here we have are not and then uh, all you have to do is pull that tight and there you go that's up there against nice and snug and that way we'll have a nice ridge line set up for our tarp shelter or just throwing up a tarp in general and then to get this knot out real easy all you gotta do is just pull that slack back um, pull that through and that way we're not out there just cutting paracord up because we can't get the knot undone. Real simple, real simple and easy to do. All right, so our second knot's gonna be a jam knot. And I believe it's called the Canadian jam knot. So what we're gonna do is we're just gonna make a nice simple uh, overhand knot at the very end of the paracord and you want to pull that tight so on the tail end right here we have about one to two inches until we run out of paracord and then we're going to make a second knot the same way except this time we're not going to cinch it all the way down we're just going to get it uh, fairly close to the other knot right here so you should have something that looks like this once you have that up we're going to set this down and this is really good for uh, if you want to add stuff to your pack using paracord. Uh, so what we're going to do is we're going to take our X, our end of our paracord and we're going to run it through that uh, loose knot that we made. And then we're just going to pull that like this. I'm just going to keep working it. So there you go. Cinch it up real good. And just like that, you can add this to your pack, you know, make it obviously tighter, uh, do all kinds of things with that. And the beauty about this knot is, again, really simple to uh, get loose. All you gotta do is pull that through. And then undo that. And then you're left with your single overhead knot that we tied in the beginning. So there you guys go. <clears throat> Alright, so our third and final knot is going to be called the clover hitch. And all we're going to do is twist it like this. So we have our loop. We got one loop. And then what we're going to do is do the same loop again right below it. So you want to have probably a good uh, three to four inches at the very end. And then all we're going to do is put that second loop through the first loop. Then we're going to pull this tight. And there you go. We have our clover hitch. And if you have uh, something attached to that, you can yank on it. It's not going to go anywhere. And then all to do to get this knot out is simply pull on this. And there you go. No more knot. That's my three simple... Uh, bushcraft camping outdoor survival knots if you guys want to see more knots definitely drop me a comment down below what knot you want to see me do i hope this was uh, informative and we're going to do a quick giveaway so here you guys go as you guys can see i will give this away at random to whoever comments on the video and tells me their three favorite knots hope you guys like this video uh, definitely hit that like button, subscribe if you haven't already, and I will see you on the next one.